Rolling wrench here. This is an in-depth view of the Type A stator. This is the most common stator found on a GUI 650cc. So notice that it has got five copper um, pickups or stator or coils, five copper coils, and one that's wrapped in white tape. Looks like so. There's six coils, two uh, bolt holes. They all mount up the same way. Then you've got a pickup coil. This goes, uh, let me grab this magneto. When you have your magneto over your stator, this little guy here, as it spins, it's telling the engine when to spark from that magnet. So it's bolted down to the engine and then this is installed. Also on the Type A stator, there is a three-prong three plug. Notice that there's three prongs. Some of these won't have the green wire in there. It'll all be a three prong just like this, but this green wire will be gone. This is a ground wire. It grounds itself internally so it wouldn't be needed. It also has two colored or two wires here. So we've got a three prong with two wires. The same stator, if you're looking to, if you have one of these type A stators installed on your scooter right now that has the green wire missing, you can still buy the type A stator. It will work. So uh, that's the type A stator. Um, if you're trying to remove this magneto, you'll need this tool. This is a uh, magneto or rotor puller. It screws in like this. You screw it all the way in, all the way in, and then tighten this guy in the back and then it will release it off of the crankshaft of the engine. So if you need a type A stator, be sure to pick up this part if you don't have it because you're not going to get it off if you don't have it. RollingWrenchDenver.com